This video is to show you that since I taught you Google Drive that the very next week Google came out with a new view in their new Google Drive. So I just want to walk you through some of the options and the differences. Go ahead and log in um, to your Google Drive. Make sure that you go to the matrix and you're down to Drive and not Gmail. Once you are in the Drive, you're going to go to the gear because you can experience the new Drive right now. If you click on the drop down menu, experience the new Drive. As soon as it opens up, you're going to notice that it's actually very, very similar to the old drive, but I want to point out some different views. Over here, you're going to notice that there's no more shared with me. It's now called incoming. So it didn't go away, they just changed the name. So if you click on incoming, it will show all of the different things that have been shared with you in the past. Now, you, if you want to um, download it or if you want to put it into your Google Drive, all of the icons to do this are right over here at the right. If you download, it's going to come right down here in the left-hand corner of Chrome. If you click on Add to My Drive, you can choose where you want it to go and then click on Move. You can also do more options. You can open with if you have the capabilities, you can share. I do not have the capabilities to share this document. Add a star. If you needed to, you could rename it make a copy, or you can actually remove it. The other thing in New Drive is that you're going to notice that this is now says New instead of Create. If you click on it, there's the folder that you can create, the file upload, the folder upload, Google Docs, Google Sheets, Google Slides, and then you actually have your Google Forms and Drawings that's right here. It used to say Create and then gave you the list, and now it actually says New. The other thing that you can do with My Drive that's really cool as far as the new drive goes, you have, if you have a file on your doc, your desktop, what you do is just click on it and drag it right into your Google Drive. It actually ends up uploading it, putting it right there into your Google Drive. I now have three copies of this, and you'll notice that it still keeps it over here. I can then drag that to the trash to actually get rid of it because I don't need it. It's in my Google Drive right now. Those are the new features of Google Drive. Um, hopefully this video helps.